Good morning, world. Look, it's a sunny, beautiful day after a snowstorm. I need to go for a run, but look at this. Our freaking, our door is frozen shut. So I can't go. There's no way for me to get out of the house. We have the space heater excuses, going. Excuses, excuses, excuses are useless. How am I gonna get out of the house? How? Oh my God, it's frozen shut. Thanks for being frozen, I have to run now. Yeah. I've wasted so much time today trying to figure out what this disc is. On Facebook, someone is giving away some discs if you can guess which um, what disc this is. You have to do whatever he says. And the clue is the man manufacturer's name and the name of the disc both begin with the same letter. For what it looks like, it looks like an orc or something like that, but it just, I cannot figure it out. I can literally not figure it out. And I'm like, Okay, I don't want to sound overconfident, but I feel like I I can name like any disc just by feel by looking at a disc I should be able to name virtually any disc by that too because for some reason I know the way every fris frisbee feels except this one I cannot figure it out I've been going through like disc golf's website trying to match up things and it just does not match The only thing that I can think of is like the Vibram Vamp or the Vibram Valley, but the plastic doesn't look like Vibram. It's driving me crazy. It's absolutely driving me crazy, man. I don't know what I'm going to do. It's time. I'm heading over to Voodoo Hair Salon. I'm going to get my freaking hair white. White has the snow on a winter day. I will be bringing snow to Christmas. Snowy, snowy, white Christmas. A white Christmas with eagles, snowy white hair. The D is done. I can honestly say it looks so different. What the heck? It's insane. I'll do the big reveal once I get back home. Whew. Freaking Katie knows what she's doing. This is like no disc golfers has ever looked like this before. I know that for sure. I'm making history. Here we go. Are you guys ready for this freaking revolution? Oh my God. Here we go. One, two, three. Yeah. Oh my gosh, this is the most ridiculous thing I've ever done. Like the gray was pretty different, but whew, someone's looking a little frosty, I'd say. Not just frosted tips, full frosted. Frosted mini wheat? Nah, more like freaking frosting on frosting. Get fat off eating just frosting because there's no cake to go along with the frosting because it's all there. It's getting a little chilly, I'd say. Oh my gosh, I can't believe it. It's ridiculous. So freaking ridiculous. It's different. It's very different. I think it'll look good if I wear it like super emo. Day 22 is over, guys. Oh my gosh. Only two days left. Two days left until the end of Vlogmas. I'm kind of disappointed that's gonna be over, but I'm also kind of excited because they are they do take some work. And don't say a lot of work. It's basically just ripping out your phone at random times during the day to get some footage. Editing at night, it takes anywhere from uh, one to two hours, plus the upload, so like, Probably two to three hours to get it online. But you guys are worth it, I love you guys. So yesterday I asked you guys, if you could have a superpower, what would it be and why? Or something like that, I don't know. My favorite response goes out to Simon Shaw and he writes, if I had a special power, it would be to lobotom lobotomatize the ego from the brain with just a look. Christmas shopping would be so much nicer when everyone is concerned for those around them opposed to their own needs. If you had that superpower, man, you would be freaking, you'd make everyone a better person. I'm all for that. Thanks, Simon. All right, today I'm gonna ask you guys, what color would you dye your hair? Please, 
please, please, please post your interesting, funny, or creative responses in the comment section below. And until tomorrow, keep on dreaming. Oh.